Let's turn our attention now to SOLIDWORKS with the Electrical 3D add-in. To review, with the part information added to the SOLIDWORKS Electrical Library, we can take the properties and circuit definitions and set up the SOLIDWORKS part for usage in our assemblies and for routing. If you haven't checked out part one of the series, find the link in the description below to see how the Electrical Content Portal tab let us search for and add part information to our electrical library. Here we can open up our part in SOLIDWORKS with the 3D add-in enabled. This is the part we mapped to from our electrical library. So we're ready to define on the parts faces the connection points for routing in 3D. Prior to 2022, we would load the routing wizard, but let's see if this new shortcut can save us time. It helps quickly enter the routing point definition without having to wait for the routing manager to load the routing points can now land on curved faces, in addition to the planar faces that were required in the past, giving us more flexibility as we place the sketch points on the fly. Select the routing points in order, all at once, to save even more time. And if incorrect placements are made, we can now easily delete and reapply C points directly from the connection point panel. When connection points are all placed, hit the green check to confirm. Now that C points are added, this part is ready to route. Click the link below for more information and give it a try to save time setting up your routing points in SOLIDWORKS Electrical.